everyone and welcome back to my channel or if you're new here hello and welcome so today i'm here to test out cash beauty for the first time very excited um i don't really know much about cash herself i know her name is spelled khalidi i'm really sorry if i have said that completely wrong i am not great with saying names i tried to do a google translation and it just sounded not right so i apologize for that in advance so i'm just gonna say Cash Beauty but in case you don't know much about the brand um, Cash herself is a Irish influencer and also owns the brand like created the brand basically and I thought I would check out some of her videos beforehand because obviously if I'm going to talk about a brand or something I should probably know about the person but she just seems like the most nice like just standard MUA basically and influencer so I've always been intrigued about trying this brand even though I've known nothing about them um, and I was on Be Perfect's website and they actually had a bit of a discount going so I actually got the Crystal Knights palette um, which normally I think is about £25 I got it for £12.95 so I'm very excited to try this. I also picked up one of their lipsticks. This is in the shade uh, Blood Moon, which is a red, of course. So I'm actually quite excited to test out the palette today. Well, and the lipstick, of course. So that's the outer packaging. When you get inside, you get the nice, like really hard plastic kind of packaging as well. So, you know, it's quite sturdy. And then when you open it itself, you got a lot of nudes and then you've got these two shades. This purple was one of the reasons that I want to try this palette because it is absolutely stunning. They do have um, quite a few other products on their website. They have a quite a few eyeshadow palettes and lip products. So I am going to start off with the eyes today, but I'm actually going to put on some sellotape because I need to like, yeah, make a good look today. All right, so we're ready to go. I will put up some swatches of the palette itself I don't do live swatches because I'm so bad at them so I feel like I'm going with a bit of a random look today because I feel like this palette um, I personally would struggle to get like a one suitable like color look when I was looking online for a bit of influence but um, there wasn't anything that I would like wanted to like copy for example so I'm just gonna kind of just use whatever shades and hope that we do a good look so I'm gonna start off with haze just at the top here we are going to take a corner brush because these are the type of brushes that I like to start off with a transition. You get a beautiful mirror in here, seeing the rest of my flat. Um, but yeah, I just thought um, like I would pick up something from this brand because I want to try new brands. Like in my last video, I tested out Lorac. Um, and again, that was a brand that I have like never tried before because... I mentioned in there also that I'm just bored of using the same brands again and again that have the same makeup ideas and the same styles and blah 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 and same colours and I thought I would try at least um, a couple of different brands and especially when this is a brand by like a YouTuber like slash influencer and MUA as well so she's a makeup artist so she knows what she's talking about when it comes to like making these products so so far it's a very creamy matte shade that's very strange um it's kind of like you got a bit of fallout it's nothing too crazy but the way that when you put the brush in there it's very soft so when you do use this you have to be quite careful um but it's very very pigmented like you can definitely see that as like a nice kind of first transition shade and then next I'm going to go in with Enchant, which is whoop, just at the bottom here. So this is a much deeper kind of like chocolate tone. So that is going to be um, to kind of deepen up my edges. I'm hoping it's not going to make it look too harsh, but we are going to go for it because that's what I want. So deepen this up. I was so um, like happy to see this brand in a lot of places because you can also purchase them on Beauty Bay. Um, and like I mentioned, Be Perfect and on their website as well, they all have different bundles for all different prices as well. So it's a little bit um, like weird, but if you obviously want to try out a brand, definitely check out lots of different websites because one website will have one thing, another website will have like a discount and stuff like that. So I thought, I thought cause I was on the Be Perfect website anyway, and they are oh, like, sellers for so many different brands and when I saw this on there and I saw that it was 12 95 I was like I definitely want to test it now and then the lipstick was 
10.95 so that's the standard price for the lipstick which is pretty good and then this is like not half price but almost kind of almost half price so yeah this is enchant so so far it's looking pretty good it's kind of blending in quite nicely with the first shade and then now let's go into a smaller brush and we are going to go in with dusk just in the middle and we are going to it's a bit of fallout i don't know if it's my brush or just the palette itself but um you have to be a bit careful i know a lot of people don't have issues with fallout i sometimes do mind fallout just because it just makes the palette look so messy um i like to be quite clean with my makeup um but you know you can just like use a wipe to clean it off so not the end of the world so oh that's very nice it's kind of shaping out my eyes because i'm kind of wanting to try looks where I don't go all the way up because it just makes the look a little bit too heavy. Um, I want to try different techniques as to how it works. So there is like a lot of fallout in this one. So I'm trying to like pick up what is like fallen just so I don't tap too harshly in the palette. Okay. And this turned up quite quickly with Be Perfect as well. Like I never have really any issues with be perfect like they um yeah anything that they send to me they always package really well um and obviously it comes by the post office and recently i've not had any issues with the post office but with like hermes slash every they are just absolutely terrible i ordered from beauty bay like a week and a half ago and they attempted to deliver three times attempted to deliver that's like the chat in absolute shit um <laughs> and they sent back my item it wasn't any makeup so it's not like it was for my channel or something but it was stuff that i really wanted um obviously that's why i ordered it and they decided to send it back so i had to get my money back from beauty bay but alas what can you do so that was um dusk that's really nice i've gone a little bit heavy on this side but we'll kind of blend it out when um, I put on my foundation. Now I'm going to go in with a shimmer because um, I want to put a shimmer at the top and then later I'll put some shimmers at the bottom just to kind of test out the purple. And that's why I said this look is going to be quite random. Um, I'm going to go in with bronzite just here. So I don't think this is the right brush. Let me find something that will work. So this smaller brush will hopefully be all right. And... Ooh a lot so let's get this on the looks that i've seen on their website are very um kind of like minimal but to the point very pigmented those are kind of not really like my type of look when i do these when i do looks i want to kind of go all out i want to make use of these palettes and the looks and the shades i might not always achieve a best the best look but i try my best and just making use of like all the shades because I want to actually test them out even though it's another excuse for me to just use the palette again like on another time so right this is very nice I'm going to go in with a smaller brush and I'm going to go in my inner corner with the shade crystal to see how that will work as like an inner corner shade and oh that's gold that's gold that's very nice all right perfect so i am now going to go off camera do the rest of my face and then we'll go on to my lower lash line and then the lips okay so now we're going to go into amethyst like i mentioned i'm so excited to try this so i'm actually going to use this smaller brush because this is the, the smallest brush that i have to kind of um be quite precise so this was just what i used the shimmer on i believe so we're just going to go in with amethyst and live our best life and let's hope it doesn't look really stupid and shit, but let's go and see how this works. If it's got too much of the other shade, I might just try and get another brush if it works. But let's go back in. There were some looks I saw that mixed the purple and the blue, um, which was pretty good. I might not do that, but this purple is okay 
it's taking its time to build up but again I did say this look was going to be very random <laughs> I look quite ill today oh my god there's nothing new with me okay wow okay we're doing all right I mean I can see the pigment is there but I just don't think it's showing up as well on my lower lash line I don't know if it's just me <laughs> um yeah I mean it's come out quite nice so let's now move on to the lips before we're here for like 700 hours so yeah this is in the shade blood moon this is one of their matte liquid lipsticks they do have um I think they have lip kits so you can get a lip liner and also um obviously a lipstick as a set um, I didn't want to purchase any because they didn't have the red one otherwise I would have purchased that one so this is just the case itself it's got cash just written all over there um, it said it has a vanilla scent so yes it does it's very nice um, it just looks like a nice kind of creamy lipstick so let's have a look oh yeah it's very creamy that's very nice very buildable as well so it's not like crazy pigmented in the beginning but you just build it up wow that's very nice I mean I wish I had a, a lip liner I'm not very good at um just like straight putting it on uh, but everything let me take down my hair because it makes me look better um, does look pretty good I mean this lipstick is very nice it's very smooth again it's pretty creamy it smells nice I'm gonna try and put this back in the right place because it's gonna annoy me if I don't there we go um, but yeah everything all together I do pretty like I do quite like I think this purple might have to be used maybe by itself next time as opposed to just on my lower lash line or maybe with a cleaner brush that was my fault uh, probably and the rest of it looks gorgeous like this kind of copper look I never really go for as much but I do really like my first impressions of the brand pretty good I mean I will be hopefully trying out more in the future again if brands like Be Perfect and stuff or Beauty Bay have a massive sale I will probably be on there to be honest like they are pretty still pretty affordable I think for this 20 I think 24 or 29 pounds for just this mmm okay um but so far i do like this and yeah i'm quite happy so let me know if you have picked up anything from cash Butte before i know they've been out for about a year or maybe a bit longer um but yeah this is my finished look thank you so much for watching hope you have enjoyed the video please don't forget to like and subscribe because i film and upload every time i get a chance to don't forget to follow me on any of my social medias because i'm always active on there and i hope you guys are doing so well and i'll see you soon Bye bye <music>